Hi everyone, and I am here again to discuss another business topic from our book Communicating in Business. And of course, today we'll continue what we had finished from our previous video. Okay, so now are you ready and excited to discuss more about the topic and to learn more of situational English where you can practice making your conversation? Oh, great to know that. Well then, on our previous video, we did, unfortunately, there's a problem topic. Alright, so we also finished the text as well as the true or false exercise. And then, um, of course, the problem solving on the telephone. Now we'll do another page. It's from 47. Unfortunately, there is a problem topic. It's still under this unit number five. So, as you can see, we have here the flow chart. Okay, conversation over the telephone between the customer and the supplier. Of course, first you have to do the introduction and getting who you want. The response, greeting, and small talk. So, you for introduction, you may first say your name and why are you calling or the reason for calling okay you may say like uh, i am calling for something or i am calling to complain about something and this is lean or you can also give of course your name and then greeting and small talk the suppliers reply small talk about um something that is related from the reason why you're calling and then starting stating your problem like your complaints um tell whether it's the first time or not you can also uh, give your specific reasons um or complain and of course the supplier must apologize okay apologize or the supplier uh, should give the apology and then suggesting solution for the complaints or the problem and of course agreeing suggested solution saying okay or yes then later on the confirmation apology again and the call and and the call greeting all right so for this uh, activity you may also get your own paper and make your own dialogue using the same conversation model like it's the conversation over the telephone between the customer and the supplier okay so you may start it okay so uh, that's it for that now let's do the picture okay what do you think they are uh, talking about And then practice okay work in pairs create your dialogue based on the cues below okay a, a is for the client services manager of keen investment who calls B a financial advisor a is B's boss so this is Erica or Erica King Charles Charlotte Heppel letter B okay this is the boss all right so of course at first you have to introduce yourself and say there is a problem you may use those sentences like um i'm having a problem or i'm complaining about something okay okay uh first one charles would answer the phone and introduce and say there is a problem respond and of course ask what is the problem then respond explain problem Okay, a client, Sandra Henson, has called. She expected CH to visit yesterday. No one came. So it was like um, they did not keep the appointment or the agreement. Respond, the client has made a mistake. The appointment is for next week. So it was a bit of misunderstanding. And then respond properly, appropriately, ask CH if he, he or she wrote with details of the visit check if it is written and then offer to call Sandra Henson and a call small talk and then ending a call
Now, how do you make that um, small talk? You can insert related things, okay, about the thing that you're talking about, especially the problem, and try to give or explain more. And then, of course, the solution. So now, class, are you ready? Let's try if you can also do it. Okay, you may start it now. Okay. So, I think that is enough for the conversation over the telephone for today. I hope that would help you a lot, okay, in handling situations like this, especially for your business. Okay. And I want you, of course, to review okay the flow chart and try to make as many as possible okay and again this has been teacher lean i'll see you again on our next video and have a great day everyone bye